everyone so I want to do a video going over whether we needles actually cut the fibers in your fabric I heard that they can and I just wanted to investigate it so I'm gonna take some um, scrap white Nola and I'm going to do hem stitching pin stitching whatever whichever one it's called um, with a weenie I'm going to use a hundred size hundred and I'm going to use some bright pink thread so there's no confusion on what is what and then I'm going to back it with water soluble stabilizer so I can just rinse it when I'm done and there's no worry on like did you know tearing the stabilizer behind it cause the fibers to rip so let's get started <laughs> Okay, so I think the conclusion, although I didn't do a large sample size and I realized that, but I found two where it had, it had um, cut the fiber. I was very, very careful with my seam ripper, so I really do not think that I cut any of these with the seam ripper. And I just did a small section to begin with, and I'm trying to remember now what, what happened. <laughs> So I opened up so that there were more holes and um, just to increase the sample size and um, I can't remember if I found the second one at that point or if I was in the first one but I found two overall then I went over to the other row of stitches and I um, removed the thread from there as well and I didn't find any there. I didn't find any um, places where it had actually cut the fiber there. There are also a number of places where it weakened. Like on the second one, I thought that there was a place that it had cut, but turns out it had just weakened. It had, I guess, maybe like pierced the side of that fiber and not actually like the center of it, so it didn't actually cut through it, but it's like weakened. Um, but that being said, I guess the next question is, so what? Does it actually come out of your, of, does it actually like weave out of, you know, that cut fiber? Um, does it actually weave out of the fabric over time? Like, I don't know, because basically you're wrapping this up, and yes, I used this, this huge pink thread, and I was thinking as I was ripping it out, I should have used like water soluble or something, but this is the first time I was doing this little uh, experiment. Anyway, so, so, you know, coming from the land of like hand done buttonholes and cut work and things of that nature, like, it's okay. You can you can cut part of your fabric out and you can wrap her up and all is well. And I mean, Audrey's second birthday dress, I did cut work embroidery and she partied hard at that birthday party. All like all the cut work is still intact. There's actually a part of the seam. Her her daddy was like flipping her over doing that number and there's part of the seam that I need to repair, but all the cut work is fine and all the fabric like it's all good. So so I guess the next question is even if it pierces your fibers here and there, does it matter? I, I, I don't know, because you know, you can do, like I said, hand button buttonholes and cut work and things like that, and it doesn't uh, unravel, um, at least in the couple of years I've been doing it, it hasn't unraveled, so there you go. Does it actually matter in the long run? That's the question. So I don't think that it does my gut feeling coming from, like I said, coming from the handwork side of buttonholes and cut work and things like that. Um, but yeah, that's the little uh, experiment that we did. I hope it was helpful. But if you have any questions, of course, leave them down in the comments below and I will do my best to answer them. And as always, I appreciate y'all for watching and I hope to catch y'all next time.